What is up, everybody? My name is Hudson. Welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Repentance. Let's see something fun today. Tainted Bethany to Dogma. These are runs that I do on stream a lot. First of all, Tainted Bethany, what's her deal? We no longer have the Book of Virtues. We no longer have the protection of the Blue Fires, but we do have Lamegidin on our Q slot. So if I use it, we get these special purple fires that take the place of passive items. So as long as I have this fire, A, it will do contact damage, it will block shots, I think, and B, it will spawn the corresponding passive item, this one being Mystery Egg. We can use red health to have charges, to use the book. You know what I mean. One tick of Lamegidin is one red heart, or actually it's half a red heart is one. So I think three full red hearts will get you a full charge of Lamegidin. We only have soul hearts, kind of like Blue Baby, and we're going Dogma, so ideally, we will be skipping our item rooms and trying to get a planetarium. Because with Dogma, you go back up through the floors and it allows you to get back into any item room that you may have missed. That only applies to item rooms though. Let's see here, shops are gonna be important. Any permanent item that we can accumulate is going to be a big deal. I can get both of these things. Yes, genius. Shot speed up. Shots. Item room, skip it. Don't do it. This is gonna be really tough though, you guys. Nothing but soul hearts is already hard. And I'm pretty sure that uh, Tainted Bethany just gets like worse items. Oh, another important thing to note about Lamegidin. It depends on where I actually pop the book. So if I pop the book in an angel room, I think I get angel items from it. So we should keep that in mind. We're gonna go angel with all soul hearts. Yeah, absolutely. Sack me. All right, okay. Look at all the stuff that they're just throwing at me. We do not have to go alt path, so I probably won't. Bigger room here, I think. I knew it. And now the key. I was hoping for items. I really was. Two pennies out of a golden chest is just a big F you. Huge middle finger. Top secret room. Ooh, sparsy. Give me an item. How about an item? How about a fire right upgrade? Ah, shoot. I gotta remember to pick up red health though. So like normally as a blue baby, you just, you don't even see it. You don't even register the red health. I gotta remember I can collect it. Damn it, or Scrooge. I got a Lamegidin, should I use it? I might get a, like a health upgrade or something. What do I get? Divorce papers, tears up, great, perfect. Once again, boss room, so boss room item from it. I think maybe collecting a bunch of red health as much as I possibly can and then saving that for deals of the devil or angel. Like I said, going angel here because I can't afford to give up my health unless I get some sort of ridiculous item or health generation. It's so crazy to me how deals of the devil went from something that was just like accepted and like you knew it was just really, really good to now being this thing where you're like, I can't do that. I can't give up health for a deal of the devil, like ever health upgrade. Do I wanna try to get blanky here? Kinda, yeah. And blanky we shall have. Gives me plus one soul heart. Also a holy mantle shield uh, upon entering a boss room. Next floor. So once again, we don't want to get shot, obviously for, you know, losing health, but we don't want to lose these fires. Bills, what do you got? Health up, balls of steel, go. Got to be down. The game giveth, the game taketh away. But yeah, late game, if you're not strong and you end up getting cornered and then they strip all, away all of your fires, which is like most of your items, the game gets pretty difficult. So I don't expect to have too much trouble here in the beginning, but once again, late game. Wow. Or these guys sneak up and steal your fires. Get out of here, get out of here. No, I'd like some crowd control. I'd like some permanent piercing or something. I want my planetarium early and I want a Uranus. And Uranus? Iconium, sometimes we get black poops to shoot. I'd be tempted to just like poke my foot into the deal with the devil and pop the Lamegidin book, but yeah, nah, it ain't happening. I'm using here again, speedball. Okay, whatever. I wonder if I can get spun if I get three syringes. Okay, stop touching my fires, please. The reason I'm picking the boss room, of course, is, is the high probability of DPS upgrades. Boss room is pretty stellar. What do we got? A perma DPS upgrade. Happy to have it. Once again, skipping that first deal with the devil that locks in angel chance, at least for the next one. Very nice. Oh, that was close. I unlocked it and I was thinking I was going in, but man, I really have to get back into the mindset of skipping item rooms. We've already done, I feel like most of the dogma runs. I'll be excited that I saved this one just for you guys. Dice room, yeah, sure, what do you got? Reroll, one. Um, what do we have right now? DPS upgrade, blanket, and health upgrade with luck. We could reroll it. I don't think it'll be that strong though, but now I gotta get that key. I'm pretty okay where we're at. 
We should probably go into all of our shops just to see if we can buy soul hearts for health. Classic blue baby strategy. Next floor. We pretty much have to full clear to see if we can find our planetarium. Imagine skipping item rooms to get a planetarium and then you just didn't even see it on the floor. I suppose another reason to use my Lemegidin inside the boss room would be the chance to get... Oh, that put it in my red hearts. Come on. The chance to get eight ball for that increased chance for planetarium. Chance for this for a chance for that. Lemegidin. What, what's the challenge room? What's the pool here? Holy light. Awesome. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We could also walk into our curse room to use Lemegidin. That would be a pretty decent pool. I would really love to get, like, a really spicy active item as well. Pills. Addicted. That is trippy. Skip the item room. Skip the item room. Skip the item room. Don't even look. Line them up. Get them all packed together for my holy light shots. Boom. Boom. Half off hell. Boom. The Bible. Honestly, I'd probably buy it if I get 15 cents. I'm going to use my Ligma book in this room again. Betrayal. Not very good. The more fires we get, though, the further out we can push the fires, protecting the ones on the inside, aka Holy Shot. Maybe we can get the Perfection Trinket to increase my chance for Holy Light. Probably should have charged my Ligma book. Or the Angel Room. It's fine. Probably won't get one. Holy Light Shot. Go. Big Horn here. Not a problem. Oh, excuse you. Triple ball in me, huh? Not too bad. I'm not ever worried about Bighorn. Like, very, very cool boss. Kind of non-threatening at this point in time with everything else. And we're done. Perfection Trinket. There we go. Did not get an angel room, as predicted. And are we going to use these pills? They've been okay so far. What to say, you pills? Full health is fine. Addicted again. Shot speed down. And range up. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. No planetarium on the floor. My calculations are correct. That should be 61% chance on the next floor. Ooh, some PJs. Glad I walked into this challenge room. Oh, you took my fire. That was my divorce papers fire rate upgrade. Come on. Look at the holy light chance, though. Holy light's just doing it. Thank you, perfection. We bomb into our curse room. No. Stop forgetting to pick up your red health, you dip. How about Ligma in this top secret room? Ooh, shield the tears. That's very good. Finally, next floor. 61% chance. Let's get that. Let's get that planetarium. Show it to me, baby. Don't take damage. Can't can't afford to lose this uh, perfection. Kind of weird. Our highest DPS modifier right now is this uh, piece of paper that gives us luck. Planetarium! Yo, what do you got? That is soul. Radiant victory. Soul, I believe, once you get into the boss room. Let me just read it. After defeating the shown boss fight, this item will activate the use of a sun card. Full heal, map reveal. Fully charge your active item. Remove curses from the floor. Gives plus three damage up and plus one luck for the rest of the floor. So, if we rush to the boss room and then defeat it, we'll be able to handle the rest of the floor better. And we'll get full map. Oh, we could use our Ligma inside of the planetarium. Uranus, please. Neptunus. Isaac will now automatically charge up tiers, allowing you to store them up and fire them rapidly for a short time. Very, very cool. Very cool. We can honestly just keep popping the Ligma with our red heart charges. It's not not a bad idea. Uranus, yeah. Oh, it's, isn't it spelled Uranus? <laughs> Them go away. Oh, okay. Ooh. Uranus, by the way, is shooting ice tears that slow enemies and freezes them. It's pretty awesome. Of course, these are all temporary, let's not forget. But look at that. Look at that. If I stop shooting for a little bit, then we charge up. It's almost like a cool cursed die without the punishment. Look at this. It's crazy. This is crazy good. This is super crazy good. Got another Ligma charge. You know what? I'm going to hold on to it for the Angel Room. Hard Against Humanity. Those are pretty good. Let's get it. And go to one of those extra large rooms and uh, just go ham. Dope. Trinket. Give me the trinket early, please. I'll be here for as long as it takes. Oh, think about all the red health we're going to get too from this. Ooh. Please, trinket. Please. Almost done. No trinket. Still got a bunch of red hearts, though, and some money from it. I think that all the passive Lemegeton 
items that we've got uh, that we've received should be shown in my items list but maybe as like a bright blue colored version boss fights prepare thy anus and we're done and there's my angel room and there's a damage upgrade what do you got perma holy shot Ooh, holy water also really 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 good oh this is a tough choice you guys i'm gonna go with what if it stacks though i don't have a bomb for the angel statue shoot my magenton what you got to say halo all stats up wonderful i'm gonna go with the holy water one of my favorite upgraded items from zero to absolute hero holy water's great i would have probably taken holy shot had it not been for the fact that we already had it passively once again let's pop our lemme jeton soul spear of destiny miter immaculate conception mind glyph of balance seraphim and the mind look at that we have soul body and mind not too many damage, not too many uh, DPS uh, changes there. Let's go. Miter's pretty okay for us, considering we're all soul hearts. So we'll just see how long we can keep these. Now that we have a planetarium, we can go for our item rooms because skipping item rooms no longer buffs our pl planetarium chance. I think right now it's just gonna be back at a flat 1% chance. Look at me go. Huge plays on the Uranus. Ooh, that is a good trinket as well. A very, very phenomenal trinket, but we don't have to go with the perfection until for, for now. We won't be able to keep it forever, so like maybe I shouldn't, but really, it's I don't know, it's a tough call. Lamegin, well, give me a mom's purse. Card reading, link to my future, okay. Item room, item room, hot diggity dog, it's my reflection. You know what? Let's do it. I'm gonna be able to create some sort of like miasma of my own blocking shielded tears around me, so hopefully. Uh, if anybody, like, is sneaking up on the sides of me or behind me, then these tears that are floating around me constantly can maybe hit them or block them before they take my fires down. I think it's going to be all right with shielded. We could have just popped the rest of our lemejeton in the planetarium to get all of them. And I wonder if it would start giving you doubles or if it would maybe give you some things from other pools. I'm feeling pretty spicy right now, though. We are going to need some sort of beefing up of our damage. All right, card reading link to my future means that it gives us teleporters when we first land. Yellow goes to our item room, blue goes to our secret room. I don't have any bombs, so I suppose maybe secret room is smarter. Plus, we'll be closer to the boss room. We could just head on over, get it done with, get that bonus that we'd be getting. I would take that sack if I could get it. Oh, hey, we still had the uh, the egg with us, and we got one of these guys. It's pretty good. I'm glad that bad trip did not strip my perfection. Oh, God, yes. My red ghosty guy is so good. I'm, I'm afraid I'm going to try to dodge him, though. I'm going to panic when I see him. Dude! Nothing personal, kid. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Let's not die. Oh, my God. Thank you, red ghost. What is your name, red ghost? You can call me Drippy Tomato Boy. Just call the red ghosts. The non-red ones are called Wazoobs. That's way cooler. I prefer Drippy Tomato Boy. Full send, baby. Full send. God, he's good. Thank you. I'll try really hard. Pandora's box. Ah, uh, womb one, I believe is is really good, but we're not gonna make womb one because dogma. I think depths one maybe is a good one too. Twenty coins the next floor though. Depths one, boss go. Red ghost, be careful up there, dude. Be careful, red ghost. Red ghost. Sorry, tomato boy. Thank you. Oof, that was close. Got up. Perfection still intact. Boneheart, no. Syringe, two thirds spun. So I do have a syringe on one of my fires that did not count towards the transformation. Okay, got it. Okie dokie then. Tomato guy, you can stop now. It's dead. I can't stop, it feels too good. Another angel room, I'm happy to see it. I got a bomb this time and a sensor, yeah. Sensor's so good. Imagine, what say you? Sworn protector. You ready, red ghost? Let's get him. Cook him up and fry him. So good. So good. Red goes. High five. Tomato. Tomato guy. I'm sorry I keep doing it. It's okay. One more charge of my lemme jeton. A soul. Is that my second soul? Do I have two soul? I think I've got two soul, two mind. Too many minds. No mind. Item room. Fast bobs. Not very exciting. Take a mystery sack with me. Tim's been awfully quiet this round. Yeah, it's just like you've been playing so well and just having a good time watching. Keep it up, man. Oh, Tim, that was really nice of you to say. What I mean is I'm too busy fucking your mom. Ha ha, I got him. It, I, I walked into that one. I'll admit. Hey, let's go curse room with this black card here. Ooh, nice. 
and onward. What of like, that's probably the best Bethany, tainted Bethany run I've ever had. What a good run. We are doing it. Let's go secret room again. Pop this here, maybe get the money. Item oh, gives me a D8. I'll grab it, but I ain't gonna use it. Top secret room gives me a tick. Lamegenin's gonna give me a Samson's chain. That could be dangerous. Samson's chain's pretty good though. It blocks shots. You can hide behind the ball. It's just too much power. It's too much power. I should not be trusted with this. Look at that. The fool card. I found it. Good thing. Didn't forget. We need that to get into the dogma thing. Last shop contains a mom's key. You know what? I got plenty of money. Whoa, easy there, tiger. Lost a fire, I don't even know what it was. What of my seven mines, maybe? Mom fight, go! Oh, it's a red stompy. I got red ghost, but job tomato, dude. Ooh, that goes, that was real close. Oh, she got me. Oh, blanket saved me. Saved me in the trinket, blanket, thank you. Blanket, more like thank it. Hallelujah. Blanky boy. Doesn't matter which one we take here. Full card out of there. Maybe go to my secret room, see if I can't pull off some sort of like crazy thing like rock bottom or something. You know what? There's some soul hearts lying around. Let's go curse room. Okay, that's nice too. Roll bomb. Knock the, yeah, perfect. Fighters, yeah, oh, perfect. Bills. Ooh, perfect. Oh, Lamegedin book, what he got? Packed, yeah! Packed your mom. Ah, oh, this, this is a pretty good one, Hots. Thanks, dude. I'm just happy to be included, really. We ready for this? Let's do it. Once again, if we lose every single one of our fires, mm, we're gonna be in trouble. We're gonna be in big, big doo-doo. Let's hope that doesn't happen. Mazo 2, though, not a forgiving floor. Uh-oh, gotta get out of that area. Oh, mom's key plus miter. That's like the fifth soul heart we got in the floor here. Samson's chain to break these chests out as well. Last item room, I don't know what it is. I'm gonna take the lefty left. The permanent miter, hey. Absolutely, now with even more miter. Look at this power. Uh-oh, oof, that was close. Curse room, Ligma gives me shade. Not that crazy, and little horn. Oh my God, still shocked at how powerful this is. There's nothing like crazy about it. Five damage, four fire rate. So when people ask you, do, do you think that uh, planetariums are worth it? I mean, look at this. Really our DPS is behind perfection, holy shot. But you know, and when people ask, is luck worth it? Another prime example right here. Last shop at 99 cents. We have there's options and four five volts. Be really cool if we had an active item that I'd like to use, especially for the dogma fight. It's possible. We still have uh, a couple item rooms on the way back up. What say you? It doesn't do anything. It doesn't do anything. It's overridden by our our charge shot. Okay. Whew. And we out of here. If I use my Lamegedin in here, is it gonna give me a boss item? Speedball. Yeah. Let's do it. Send it. Dad's note. Back up. Now it's just a sprint to the finish line. Already been inside that item room. It's going to take a while for us to get to item rooms that we haven't seen. I think next, like, two or three we've already done. Hey, did we lose Tomato Boy? Ah, oh, I didn't even notice. Sorry, Tomato. Rest in peace, you drippy bastard. When we enter the next floor, if we see that our item room is uh, lit up, like we've already been in there, that means we've already been in there. Imagine that. Hey, you got something good for me? No, bruising. We are just crushing this. Uh oh. Oh, thank God I froze him because he was going to do this like parallel boom thing. Woo! That's still not good. Can you not? Trying to like maybe leave the door right when they blow up in case one gets fired at me like a cannon. Yep, it was going to be fired at me. God, ice is so powerful. It stops like most of like the attacks when they explode. I just can't shut up about it. So happy and excited. Yeah, like the, him doing that boom move. Prime example. We should collect all the money. We're at 13 luck, so we have a high chance, I think, of luck pennies dropping. We could naturally get our luck pretty high without having to worry about losing my perfection here. Should we take this cracked key and show off the extra life now that they added? Sure. Item room, give me an active item, please. Another speedball. Hey, that's actually spun though. Hey, Lamegedin, give me something good. Lamegeton. 2020. Yeah. And little haunt. 2020 is a damage down, but uh, not when you hit both tiers and they're very tight. Look at this, look at this. This is more chance of freezing and, and holy shots. Basement two. Ooh, tech zero. Shocks between all of my stuff. And honestly, I'm very, very happy to have 
my reflection. Also a jawbone and a proptosis. Oh my goodness. Okay, so basically it doesn't even matter that we have my reflection. The tears disappear before they come back. But I'm happy to have that damage. Pay this guy off? Why not? Some health. Yeah, whatever. And last one. Glitter bombs. Last Le Mégeton, Juicy Sack, and Multidimensional. Awesome. Honestly, probably game crashingly good. Oh, we got another charge here. Let's go back. Robo Baby 2-0, whatever. Let's go home. We made it. Cracked key. So I get to go in here now. It's, uh, you have the inner child, which is the one extra respawn because we're already the tainted version. Pop that. Pop this. Mom's perfume. Mom's eye. Butt knife. Let's hope we crush it. Let's go. This is dicey. Oh, wow. Oh, no, my perfection. What the heck? You can't just start by just zapping me. Wow. Ah! Fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're fine. I'm fine. I just got caught off guard on that one. I don't even know who's activating that attack. Excuse me. Pardon me. Oh, you're stealing my fires by walking through all this. Guys, I told you late game is so difficult to protect your fires. I need to take advantage of my shielded shots. Oh, we're, we're done. We're done here. Lost soul. <laughs> yeah, right. Somebody owes me something if I can keep him alive. I deserve like a medal. God, this, the holy light shots are just not happening anymore. I think we're going to be just fine, but wow, wow, wow. Was that a huge part of our, uh, our, our DPS? There was so much noise too. I didn't even know that it was, that, that dogma was charging up that shot. I had no idea. Oh yeah, I used my shielded tears to block the poison shot. Smart, smart. Let's go, baby. We're doing it. The virus. What's my holy water doing down there? Why is that affected by gravity? No, my lost body! My metal! Mom's eye is actually really nice to have on this because it'll shoot down these uh, stalagmites and tights. Field of Tears is pretty nice for this. I can just not really worry about dodging. Sensor kind of making this a little bit tricky, but you missed. You missed, you dork. Ludovico technique. Oh God, oh no! I can't even control it, where is it? Oh, there it is. Yeah, we'll just let it sit in the back then. Okay, yeah, that worked for me. Okay, whoa, easy there. Whoop, whoop. And... Almost done. <laughs> done. Sweet. Vengeful spirit has been unlocked. I don't even know what that is, but it sounds awesome. As predicted, it got pretty difficult there at the end. Pretty difficult, I mean, still, easily my strongest tainted bethany run ever let me know you guys' thoughts on this i hope you enjoyed watching leave a like leave a comment i appreciate it a lot once again thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one see you guys too many minds no mind it's okay i know your intentions are there what a swell guy